Hey. I'm trying to find out. My son has a daughter that is 21 years old. She turned 21 in May. She has a nine-month-old baby, pregnant again. He has been has had had her for the last five years while her mother has been either in prison or running from the law. But they are through drug court. Now she's in prison for drug court. Mm -hmm. But they're trying, they're saying they're going to suspend his driver's license if he doesn't pay $1,000 by July in child support. I see. Okay. Matt, you've handled these before. I, I have. Uh, what she's talking about is, uh, you know, it, it's, 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 it's the law that basically says if you get behind on child support, it's some of the process they have put in place to go and encourage people to pay with really with without having to require people to kind of come to court. Unfortunately, uh, the situation really is pretty kind of cut and dry uh, for him to get his license uh, not suspended or unsuspended. He is going to have to get a clearance letter on the child support. Uh, I assume it's probably from DHS who probably um, issued that. So he gets a clearance letter, and then uh, if he gets that, all will be fine if his license has not been suspended. If it had been suspended, he'll need the clearance letter. And in addition, he's going to have to pay like a $25 reinstatement fee on top of the clearance letter to get everything back uh, going just fine. Gotcha. So this is all part of a process that's already in place and he's kind of he's kind of stuck in the he's process. in a machine right i mean right. it's just you know kitty you know they've they've come up they've tried to come up with a lot of different ways sure to kind of make people you know pay child support and also enforce when they don't and this is one of the things they've done and honestly you don't see it as often as probably you would think it right. takes a lot of paperwork uh and it's 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 relatively rare uh that it gets to this point but it looks like in her case that's where they are and i can feel miss pat's fr frustration but the other issues she was describing to us, Matt, really, they're kind of secondary to once you're in the system like this, you're kind of in the system. For right, a and you've just, honestly, you've just kind of got to go along. You have to work within the system. Uh, you know, sometimes the rules work very well and are very effective, and then sometimes they can almost, the result can be a little unfair, as it may be in Pat's case. But you really, you know, you can't fight it. <laughs> you just kind of go along with it. you got to play ball, get the clearance letter, and proceed forward. Okay, Ms. Pat, sounds like the yep. clearance letter is the way to go, and yep. uh, we do appreciate your call. Hope everything works out for you in the long run. Sounds like there's a lot of emotion and a lot of stuff going oh, on. Yeah.